everyone who gives a shit about Eastern Europe. Bad news, comrades. After reviewing the worst reviewed restaurant in Bosnia and Herzegovina, our car broke down. We couldn't find a hotel, so we decided to set up a tent, which turned out to be a horrible idea, because my cameraman fucking Vladimir got drunk, snored like a bear, and I didn't get much sleep. We gotta find a hotel for tonight. I refuse to spend another night in the Bosnian wilderness. And you know us, the hotel is gonna be terrible. Welcome to the last episode of this series. Mm. You know the drill, tripadvisor.com, Bosnia and Herzegovina. If you wonder why we're in this Bliatifu Balkan country, a pig chose it for us on our last episode. And to make it more interesting, we're not gonna look only for hotels, we're gonna include bed and breakfasts, inns and also specialty lodging. All right, let's set the date for tonight and go to our favorite page, the last page. Okay, hotels with no reviews on the last page, so let's go backwards and find the last hotel with reviews. Hmm, page 54 and we found it. Hostel Bas Baskarshia. There are no photos of the rooms here. A warning sign, I guess. So what are the reviews saying? Why is Hostel Bas Baskarshia the worst one in Bosnia and Herzegovina? The hostess stole our clothes out of our backpacks. We first could not believe that she did it because she acted very kind and when we did find out that part of our clothes missed, she acted very shocked. Awful, filthy broken showers, not at all as described. Completely disgusting. I've stayed in hostels all over the world and never seen anything like this. To make matters worse, I had a private room which was locked at all times, yet I was robbed. Don't go! 200 euros were missing from our locked room. No toilet paper, no warm water. The lady turned the water off. When we arrived, two Italians were looking for their shoes and accusing the owner for stealing it. Now we believe them. Really creepy woman, always spying you when you are in your room. Manipulative woman, she's faking to be nice, but she just wants to steal in your bags. I stayed at the hostel with my friend and it was the biggest mistake I ever made. I would rather sleep on a street next time. If there is any possibility, those people will make way to lie to you and to rob you. Everything is dirty and old. Never go to this hostel. The old woman looks at you when you sleep. She has stolen our money and also clothes. The daughter is also in the conspiracy and she steals with her mother. We thought they were nice people and nothing is less true. Shame for Bosnia. Report it immediately. Are you kidding me? No warm water, okay, we can deal with that, but man, they're stealing stuff from our rooms and lockers. And we have filming gear worth $10,000 here with us. Well, I guess this is the season finale everyone wanted. I'm booking one room for two people for one night on Hostel World. It costs 19 euros and 15 cents. Mm, a pretty good for a room, but the total expense may reach $10,000 at the end. All right, let's pack our things and find our hotel. Vladko, poďme. Zbalíme stan a ideme do hotela. Nie idem nikam. Vlado, poslednú epizódu robíme. Poslednú epizódu sme sa dohodli, Peťo, že budeme normálne... Pos, posledná je epizóda je v Bosne a Hercegovine. Je je b... ja tu robím Vlado, idiota, aby, aby si bol v stane, zaspeš ja do najbližšej Peťo, večierky a najebeš sa, ty kokot, aby si zaschrapal. Je tuplý, Jebem ťa. Ideme tuto, po toto. Ideme It was a journey through Bosnian wilderness full of blood, tears and sweat. There were a lot of ups and downs, but we eventually reached the city center of Sarajevo, the capital of Bosnia and Herzegovina. The worst reviewed hostel wasn't far away. We have a drone, two cameras, four lenses, three microphones, SD cards, tripods, $10,000. I'm really scared. We're entering the worst reviewed hotel in Bosnia and Herzegovina. God help us. Fuck me, this is the entrance. Huh. 
Hi, uh, we have a reservation. Thank you. This looks absolutely terrible. <clears throat> Beautiful view. Hello. Thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, yes, we have a reservation. Yes, yes. Ah, Thank you very much. Okay. Yes, yes. Yeah. I have the confirmation. For one night, Mister. One night. One night. Hello. Yeah, I have the I have the confirmation. Okay. I have the reservation through hostelworld.com. Hostel World. Yes, but yes, yes. This one. Nineteen euros fifty cents. For a for a room for two, double room, one room, but for two people. Bas. Baš Baščarsia. Baščarsia. Yes. Baš Baščarsia. <laughs> you don't have it. Yeah. Datum. 20. 20. Mr. Mr. Da. Mr. Drugi. One night. 10. One night. 10 euros. Yes. Perfect. Perfect. On the other side. Perfect. Hvala je. Tamo pokažem krevet. Mhm. But we made a reservation. But we made a reservation for a private room. Kako? Samo malo rooms. Reservation. For two people only. Room for two people. To vam je gut tu, super. We made a reservation for two people. Koliko ste, koliko ste people? One room for two Samo people, dva, private dva. room. Yes. Tamo je veš reservation. Oh, no problem. No problem. This is a problem. No problem, yeah. Yes, because we need privacy. Let me let 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 me show you. Let me show you. Let me show you. Let me show you. No problem. Look. Yeah. Hostel world. Hostel world. Bash bash tarsia. Bravo. Da. Yes. Basic twin private. So it's a twin private room for two people. Dobro, ja ću vas staviti da vi budete sami. Yes, sam, no, sami. This is sam. Bit ćete sami, okay. zatvorite. Okay. Peter, Peter, pošto vi će, vi ćete na ova dva, tu. No. Sami. Sami vi. Sami ja, a, 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 sami. Sami vi, sami. da, sami. Super. Ovo, ovo, ovo. Ok, good. Is there a key to lock the door? No, ne može, ne možete key dobiti to za ove pare. There is no key. Ne, ne, no problem. No problem. But there are other people. Peter, 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 no, 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 why? Tu. Why no key? Peter, nije problem. Kad sam ja tu, to je kao da je ključ. Tu sam ja. Tu, vidite da to je... Celi čas. Celi čas. Stavno. Tu, tu, tu sedite. Tu ću sediti okay. noća sa nesta... Thank you very much. Hvala. Are you fucking kidding me? It's such a shame we were not recording right now because... <laughs> Vladimir was just casually sitting on this chair <laughs> and it fucking broke. What the fuck, man? This happened after five minutes of us staying in this room. Oh, you're gonna sit there. That's your place from now. I'm kind of scared because I'm sitting on a very similar chair from 19th century. Fuck me, where to start? 
So she wanted to put us into a room for eight people with other people and I had to show her a recorded screen of the actual reservation. After she saw it, she said, oh, I'm gonna put you in this room. Don't worry, don't worry, no problem. The Wi-Fi we're connected to, well, connected is probably a strong word because we keep uh, losing connection. The Wi-Fi is from another hostel that's right next to this one. <laughs> They're stealing their fire. Wi-Fi. The interior, well, I, I think uh, there's no comment needed, absolutely no comment needed. But the most concerning part is that there's just no key in this room. And her explanation was that I'm here, I'm here all the time, don't worry about anything, nobody's gonna steal anything from you. We were still not happy about the explanation and I'm I'm not sure about this, but I think she implied that we should put this, this behind the door as a protection from thieves. Okay, this is, this is way too good not to try this. We're gonna take all our gear with us and leave $30, fake watches and a fake phone here. Vladimir is installing a hidden camera inside the lamp and uh, we're gonna turn it on and see if someone comes in and steals something from us. We're taking all the gear with us. We're also gonna tell the lady that we're leaving for three hours that we're gonna we're going to dinner and we're gonna party a little bit so she would have the confidence to come to our room knowing that we're not getting back soon. This is by far the worst place we've ever visited. Time to check the shower and then turn the camera on and leave. But the view is absolutely stunning. Look, Sarajevo, beautiful. Oh man, look at this shower. Look at this. Fuck me. Nine people from Bangladesh just uh, arrived to the hostel and they're taking turns in this shower. What the fuck is here? Why are there jeans here? There's also no key here. I cannot lock the door. She said she will make sure nobody will enter. The hostel lady told me I have only five minutes because there are way too many people waiting for the shower. So I gotta make this really fast. The floor is completely wet, look. Probably not as bad as the shower. Um, that I experienced in Cameroon, but that wasn't a hostel, that was a fucking cargo ship. No, 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 no. Fuck, somebody just entered. Oh, they saw my naked ass. The water is cold as fuck. <gasps> Star. Oh, I'm gonna be so healthy after one night in this hostel. Yes, one minute. One minute, yes, I know, I know, one minute. The hostel lady is kicking me out. The feeling after a cold shower is amazing. I'm gonna be so healthy. Thank you, hostel Bash Bash Charvilia. We're leaving the room. We're leaving the phone the watches someone comes in <laughs> oh what's this thirty dollars right in front of their eyes they can steal the cigarettes they can steal the chocolate they can steal whatever they want and we're gonna see it right here we are going for a dinner two hours then we come back okay bye 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 bye. So she thinks we'll be gone for two hours. Perfect. Mm -hmm.
We've just finished our dinner with Vladimir. Uh, this is gonna sound really strange, but I hope someone stole something from our room. We're gonna find out in like uh, 10 minutes. Yes. We were out for one and a half hours. Let's see if they stole something from us. Hello. Nothing was stolen, but maybe someone entered the room. Let's check the footage. We are going for a dinner. 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 Two hours, then we come back. Perfect. No problem. Perfect. No problem. Okay. Bye. We, we've just seen the footage and this is unbelievable. The lady entered our room at least three times. First time, it seems that she just brought some towels and sheets, but then she said something. She, she looked at our things. Most of the bags were not there. And she said something, but we cannot figure it out. We cannot figure out what she said. I've tried to apply some noise reduction filters on the audio, but I just cannot figure out what she said. If you're from Bosnia and Herzegovina and you understand what she said, please let me know. The second time she, she entered our room after about an hour and she just turned on the lights. She just turned on the lights and left immediately and the third time she entered our room the camera just uh, shut down because of the battery that's such a stupid coincidence so we have no idea if she was searching our stuff or what she was doing <sighs> what a shame i don't want to accuse her of anything but it looks very strange. How can someone enter your room without your permission at least three times? We're definitely confronting this lady with this situation. We may actually show her the footage. I'm not sure about that yet. Yes? Yes? Hi. Papuche. Papuche, thank you. That was her again. It's half past midnight. I don't want to accuse her of anything. But I need to know what she was doing here the second and the third time. Good night. Good morning. What a lovely view. Look at this. Let's confront the lady with the fact that this is the worst reviewed hotel and with everything we've seen yesterday. Since uh, the lady doesn't speak English and we don't speak Bosnian, um, we're gonna use Google Translator. This is uh, the first part of our questions. Let's go. Okay, 
ask you something. One question. Can you read uh, this text? Internet is a service for the address. I pošto imam mnogo, mnogo, mnogo adres, a vikend nisu došli, doći će. Okay. To je taj problem. Ok. Izvati. Second thing. Second thing. Hi. Ne. Internet. No. No. Internet svašta piše. Internet piše. No. Takže nije ni pravda? No. Nije ni pravda? No, nije pravda. Mnogo ljudi svašta... Petar, svašta izmišljaju. No. U vašoj sobi sam ostavila samo ove plahte. Ja. Eno ne plahte. Ano. One time. Just one time. Only once, just one time, only once, only once. Sada koliko sam puta ulaza, je li to? No, iba jedan krat, sada ne je ovo vijac krat. No. Šta to, šta to, sada se interacije. Last question. Čujte, nije niko ništa uzeo. Ovo je soba otvorenog tipa. To ne zatvorenog, a vi ste ipak zatvorili vrata. Ali što ste to robili? Što ste robili? Ja moram da budem ja i čistim, i radim, i pregledam, i ostaj i živite s telefonu. Prvi krat, toto. Ok? Ja. Drugi krat, čo? Treći krat, čo? Pa da vam kažem, ono je trebalo biti ovako stavno otvorno. Zbog ovih gostiju da sam da tvorila. Evo imate tu. Tu pravila i to i to. Nemojte mene više, pokusite mene. To je no problem. She's really mad right now. These rules don't mention that anyone can enter our private room. It seems we're not getting any explanation and the lady is getting really mad, so I guess it's time to leave. Wow, what a way to end this series. I'm giving Hotel Bash Bash Bar Charshia one star out of five without any hesitation. This was by far the worst place we've ever visited and it's the worst reviewed hotel for a reason. If you're ever in Bosnia and Herzegovina, stay away from this place, please. Thank you so much for your support throughout the whole series. Me and Vladimir enjoyed doing it very much. And see you soon, if we find a sponsor. Let's hitchhike to Slovakia.